Today marks 80 years since the most powerful and deadliest storm in New England history hit the ocean state. The hurricane of 38 claimed the lives of 600 people and took most people by surprise. Tonight we're hearing from survivors on the lessons learned over the past 80 years. Meteorologist TJ Del Santo has their story. That's new tonight. During the hurricane of 1938, boats were tossed around like toys and more than 600 people died. We spoke to some survivors of the storm who have vivid memories from 80 years ago. One newspaper headline says it all. Hundreds killed, thousands made homeless, millions estimated loss in property. An exhibit at the East Greenwich Library takes excerpts from the diary of Chief Nancy Allen, the only female fire chief in the country at the time. She documented the storm dubbed the worst in the history of Rhode Island. I didn't realize it was a hurricane. In fact, I, I didn't even know what a hurricane was. We had no idea because we didn't have news like we do now. We spoke to residents of Aldersbridge communities in East Providence. Those who lived through the storm remember the wind and storm surge. And I see the water coming up more and more and more. The more I watched, I see these trees coming down. 13 feet of water flooded Providence and winds gusted to 125 miles an hour in the city. Douglas Dean, like everyone else, had just gotten out of school. He had vivid memories of watching the Providence River from his house in East Providence. Boats being thrown up on shore, you know, off the river. Joy Millard was delivering papers with her brother in Providence when the sky was threatening. Took the remaining papers from me and said, get back home as fast as you can, just as the tree came down. Helen Cruz lived in Seacock where the winds were howling. And nearly every oak tree went, so that it was weeks before we could travel on Fall River Avenue. The hurricane of 38 took everyone by surprise. The images from 80 years ago may come to life again, but thanks to modern technology, more people will stay safe when that happens. Now we do have warnings, and now I think everybody knows what a hurricane is. And the hurricane of 1938 exhibit will be at the East Greenwich Library until the end of the month. I'm TJ Del Santo, Eyewitness News.